It was a really, really tough time, you know, but it's... Um, I don't think we were kind of taught in our generation growing up in particular to sort of like reach out. We were just told to be going, we're going to say it anyway, you know what I mean? We didn't have a massive friend circle and the, the kind of one guy that would have asked us to come for a pint, I suddenly didn't get that text message anymore. At first, I think I was just struggling to cope with my friend's death. I didn't really have a conversation with somebody about mental health till then, I don't think. He was always asking me to come out cycling, and it was just not my, not my bag at all. And I just wondered if I'd have ever joined him on that cycle, would he, would he have opened up about something or talked about something? Maybe we wouldn't have got down the route that we, that we went down. He talked about doing something like tower to tower, so from Blackpool Tower to, to Paris. So I decided I wanted to try and do a bit of a, a bike ride in his memory, hopefully raise a bit of money for charity but maybe more importantly, locally, just raise the, the subject. And the kind of more negative people, once I'd done that, kind of said to me, well, you made that very much about, about you and having your face in the paper, which I found a little bit, um, I thought, okay, you've I'm trying to misunderstood what I'm trying to do with the story here. My mum's, my dad have brought me up the right way to say, like, if you can do something and you can help somebody, try and, try and do it. So that's what the thing was about. It was like, it was a really, really tough time. You know, it's... Um, So it, so it annoyed me. <clears throat> Sorry. <laughs> Very much that cycle was about me coping with my friend's death and it, and it definitely changed my direction, if you like. And that's what we've ended up with, with now a football team that I'd like to think represents little bits of that journey that we did. Tell me who to call, tell me when I'm down, tell me when I'm out, tell me if I fall, tell me if I scream and shout, will you listen? Place to Place is a, a club for fellas facing challenging circumstances. We don't want it to just become another normal club. We want it to, to really be a place where people can, can start a conversation about having a tough time at, at, at work or at home. If you come here, it's sort of like your own counselling. You get out there and you exercise and it releases all them feel-good chemicals, which can only be uh, positive when it comes to see mental health. What Pete does is absolutely fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. I was struggling with my mental health and I came across a newspaper article regarding Place to Place and I think uh, if I hadn't seen that quite possibly um, I wouldn't be here. Kind of asked the guys to just remember that the guy that you're talking to today might have just been through a really tough time. One of the best examples of that was early doors we had a guy who was screaming at a guy saying if you're not fit enough to run around for 10 minutes what are you doing here? And the guy responded with well about three o'clock this afternoon I was stood on the bridge I remembered about a newspaper story I'd seen